Hi, welcome in. August 21. Let's go to God's word, verse 4 today. For whoever exalts himself will be humbled, and whoever humbles himself will be exalted. Matthew 23, verse 12. Esther. Esther 6, verses 1 to 13. The king can't sleep. That night, the king couldn't sleep, so he ordered his servants to read his official diary to him. When they got to the part where Mordecai had saved his life, the king asked whether anything had been done to reward him. His servants answered, no, nothing has been done. Just then, Haman walked in, so the king asked him what he would do to honor someone. Thinking that the king wanted to reward him, Haman said, the person should be dressed in royal robes and led through the city on horseback by the most important official. Good idea, the king said. I want you to lead Mordecai through the city, crying out, this is the way the king honors those who honor him. So Haman had to do as he was told. Afterwards, he went home very angry and embarrassed. Will mean unfair people get punished? Do you sometimes wish the worst on your enemies? Everyone feels like that towards those who make life unbearable for others, especially the weak. One of God's characteristics is his justice, fairness, because we are made in his image. We too have a sense of right and wrong. God is a fair judge and knows all the facts. He knows about the things that have been done to you and the times you have been treated unfairly and said something. You can be sure that anyone who has been mean and hurtful to you will not get away with it. So rather do what the Bible says. Do not take revenge, my friends, but leave room for God's wrath, for it is written, it is mine to avenge, I will repay, says the Lord. Romans 12 verse 19. He will see to it that justice is done. 